סלאם עליכום, ראשית אחר.
he didn't let us in. He said, sorry ladies, I can't take you because I'm going home for couscous. <laughs> yeah, so actually this story made me realize that yes, it's super important to prioritize things in your life. So for him it was not important to earn more money, but to go home, spend time with the family and eat couscous. Because you see, life is like a book, uh, like books. So when you, when you don't do something new, when you don't get out of your comfort zone, when you don't travel, when you don't experience new things, it's like you read the same book over and over again. Well, you know this book well, but, but it's just one book. But then when you start getting out of your comfort zone, when you start experiencing new things, doing things that, that are difficult or new, or meeting new people, then you start creating like a whole library for yourself. So every experience is like a new book. And you may wonder like, okay, but uh, I can't move out from Morocco, so far away, to another continent. But as I said, education is everywhere. So you don't necessarily have to take this big step and leave your country, go to Australia or Japan. You can, you can go like to the north of Morocco or to the south because Morocco is such a diversified country. When you go from Tetuan to Sahara, you will see that the way people that dress is different, the food they eat is different, even the language they speak is different. So you can always learn something from them. And I probably, you know, we all have somebody telling us, yeah, but uh, this is not good for you, you should do this. Or engineering is boring, you should study languages. Or why would you go abroad if you can do something in your own country? Or, yeah, this guy is not right for you, you should marry this one. But if deep inside you feel that this is not what you want, this is not the right thing for you, I would advise you to, to do like, you know, like this thing when my friend told me, yeah, when you cross the street, you just have to listen to your intuition. It's exactly the same case. So you should listen to your voice and do what, what your heart tells you to do. Because you can't let other people decide for your life. They will not leave it for you. After all, it's your choices, your responsibility, and your life. Show me